creates a big wake as it walks and we are going to use the wake of the lure to see if there's any bass around but more importantly we're going to use this just to create a lot of noise is it? Whew. I don't breathe when I, it's like almost like shooting a gun when I cast these lures. I get sort of, I suppose you call it in the zone. And two things, one I want to get a good shot in, two I want to get this right sound. thing is I want to get that visual on the strike. There's a lot of dirty water coming down here though. Maybe carp on the bottom of this. That's the sound. Chops here. I just wait. Oh, there he's there. He ah, <laughs> now that was all my concentration going into that fish, and I still missed him. And that's what wake baits are all about. That's why I think they're so exciting. Okay, now I've got a pattern going and the pattern is I've been punching a few into the gaps without no success but then once I got down low and ran the stretch it drew one and it was a slow draw he came up slowly looked at it so I got a good visual on him so I could get one just poking through these edges but the pattern will be to get up here a bit more and roll down another stretch of this water like that, like I did. You get a lot of confidence once you get a, a fish to raise to your lure. go with this pattern now for a little while. <laughs> the main reason I wish I brought a different rod for it, I, I will have to go to a live lure soon, it's just I can't get enough out of the wake bait with this smaller rod. But what this lure does is it'll draw often draw the bigger fish. He'll, take, he'll draw him a long way from his hide. There's the sound I want. And a real chop. That. Hear that? That's what I was after. Oops. My line's bird over, so I'm going to keep chopping all right. I know, it's loose now. Oh, 
I'll get back in there and do that again, and maybe again. So it's done, let's try the upper side. So you know, the fish can hear, so that any big fish in this hole heard that commotion. If I approach too close to the bank, because they can hear and see everything. Just put one there where I want to put my feet. It, and that's why. If I approach too close to the bank, because they can hear and see everything. Just put one there where I want to put my feet. It, and that's why. Ah! Oh, duh! What's the end of the weight bait section for today? Oh, that's a 10 pound leader. Just bricked it. Hmm. Well, that was how to hook a trophy fish on a weight bait and lose it, number two. First one was a little one, it didn't really bother me too much. That one hurt. It's just about to say, before I approach the hole on where I want to cast up, I want to just throw my lure and make sure there's no big lunker down there because they can hear, they can see and uh, apparently there was listen that might be the end of the weight bait session I think I'll do, if you guys like what you've seen just then because uh, normally I fish with weight baits, 20 pound braid, 20 pound leader and that's one of the reasons why, that, that was a massive fish he <laughs> was a big boy so what I might do, this rod is designed for soft plastics and small lures uh, we might we might give the big girls away for the day just go to plastics I think yeah uh, I'm gonna go to plastics that was fun though oh well yeah if you guys like that little bit on the weight bait I'll come down here with a proper weight bait rod and We'll get at them, we'll go and smash them up for a day because they definitely draw you a bigger fish. Looking for this active fish. I wish I had another weight bait. This is what this rod's designed for, is this. Make these lures dance. Mm. Now that, that one I dropped on the weight baits just still got me shaking. Oh, yeah. oh. There's one. <laughs> Never good fish. Now if you're wondering what I'm using, I've got a a tadpole, which is a weighted rig. I've taken the hook out and changed the hook. Right. So yeah, strike two. It was a nice fish. Uh, oh, I've right, drawn three good fish for no results. I'm going to go up a size in my hook. See that. Gets a better hook up rate with these fish. I can't really blame the lures when I'm fishing so quick, but that little tadpole drew a couple of fish in a small stretch of water. I've just come back down with the cicada and only drew one. I should have gone a bigger hook again yet. Yeah. Well, I'll give this a go. If I get short strikes, I'll go up again, but I still want to keep it as weedless as I can. Just got to get this in the dead centre. Probably not even seen any of what I'm doing on the camera anyway. There he is there, the hooks. 
just there. Straight through, bring the roll. Put all this away and then we'll um, get into it. Mm. There's my goat head, what's it doing down here? I hung that on a tree, oh, miles away from here. <laughs> Take you home today. Definitely feels like I should be running just a dive or a spinner right now. But um, we've got plenty of time for that. Oh, where'd you go? This is where I missed that one, first fish on the weight bait when it started this morning. That's so pretty fresh ground from here on down. The creek's starting to drop now, so it's Definitely subsurface time. Just hoping this is so irresistible. I don't think so. Why did I turn that camera off? He was angry. You had a go at it. Oh, there he is. He just flashed up again. real big but it was good it drew it took about four casts I just turned the camera off I've got them all at my feet now don't quite want to go subsurface yet I'll see if I can bring some more up He was angry, angry. Jeez, they hit him with ferocity when you draw him. Just about there. Right. One more car and just cast, and I'll switch over and get him. I think what I'll do, I'll just put a little diver on first. It was huge, huge, but I'm not going to leave a drawn fish. Now, after losing so many this morning. Okay, it was either spinner or diver. I'm thinking the way that they're drawn for these lures, I'm going to go for the, the sonic vibration of the diver. There's one straight away. Get the figure eight on him. You see, he's had two goes, three. He wants it. Oh, he's right under my feet. He's had three goes of that. It's just not going down deep enough for him. Strike two on him, or strike three on him. Let's keep going. What can we trick him with? What can we trick you with? You lash at this one, mate. There's more. Than, I've actually drawn a school up. Not real big fish. They're fun fish. Oh, I've got steam in my eyes. Sunny's a frogging. Yeah, that didn't take long. <laughs> but. Third switch, had to do it. Oh, he was only a tiny fish, that one. 
I had to do it. Uh, lost track of what I had. I turned the camera off right when he drew up the strike. Come here, mate. Come here, come here. Then I put the camera on and it was probably boring as watching paint dry the next bit because uh, I'm going to put him over here in case there was a bigger one come up. Because I couldn't draw him up again, I got one little flash, <coughs> silver flash. And then, what next? I put a little subsurface curl tail on. So you buddy. Didn't even get a look. So I needed the fish, I wanted to land him, so I then switched to the tailor made nugget. As I started doing my figure 80, he hit it three times. Then that was the end of that. So then I put on an atomic vibe, just touched the water and caught him. What the hell is that? Oh, I've got to have a look at this. I don't want to, but I'm going to have to put my gear down and get a stick. I presume it's a dog. But you just, nothing surprises me in this place. There's not one fish lives in this little creek now since they've had the, um, the development up, up from there. Nothing. Nothing, no carp living here, nothing. So I really want to know what this animal is. Yuck, yuck. I presume it's a dog, but just the short tail on it. I've seen some very weird animals around here. What is it? Yuck. What the hell is it? Oh, it's raining. Come on, come on. What the hell? It looks like a pig now. What is that? It's not my Tassie Devil, is it? I think it is. I don't want to touch it. Look at it. What the hell is it? Not a dog. Yeah. Stick in this. Sort of looks like a pig. Oh, that was rank. I don't think it's this. Oh. 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 Smell it. Oh, that was just right. Rank, rank, rank. Oh. I don't know what it was. Pig-like. 